All right, here's an example of Jesus equals a today, taking the glory for a very, very common thing in his creation. And again, just keep watching all these videos and you will see the plethora of how Jesus equals a today takes the glory for everything. The beautiful spider's web, which is, of course, spun by the eight-legged creature to the glory of Jesus equals a today, by the innumerable amount, day and night, around the clock, all over the world, well, in the Word of God, this is the exact phrase right here. For spider's web, right here, these eight letters bang on the nose. This, in the Word of God, says spider's web. That's every single spider's web that ever has existed or ever will exist on planet Earth. And this number is exactly 814 which is exceedingly glorious to Jesus equals 888. Here's 814. Here's 888. Look, they both divide perfectly by 37. And then 814 is 37 times 22. Jesus equals 888 is 37 times 24. They are both three-digit all-factor 8 numbers. 814 spider's web is an all-factor 8 number. Three-digit all-factor 8 number and divides by 37 perfectly to the glory of Jesus equals 8 at 8. And furthermore, this is accomplished in exactly 8 letters. It could not be any more beautiful and glorious. And again, folks, these spider's webs are spun by the definitive 8-legged creature, namely the spider. So, there you have it. Jesus equals 8 at 8 takes the glory for every single spider's web that ever has been weaved and ever will be weaved in the history of the world all over the planet. This is another massive, massive gem. When you consider just how beautiful these structures are, how amazing they are, and uh, by the way, we solve all spider silk. We look at the chemical molecular formula for spider silk and do the math on that, and you see that even the silk itself that spins these webs um, glorifies the number eight to the glory of Jesus equals eight to eight, the creator. And so when you consider just how many of these things there are all around the world, it's into the innumerable number. And they're all so beautiful and so intricate, dazzling each one of them, especially when they get the dew drops on them in the morning like this, and the sun shining through them. All of that glory is summarized in this exact eight letters that you are beholding with your eyes right here. And I'm going to change the font so that we can see it more clearly in the Hebrew. That is spider's web. Spider's web. Spider, or just simply spider, web. And it's exactly eight letters. Eight letters. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And it totals exactly a three-digit all-factor eight number that divides by 37 perfectly, just like Jesus equals 8 at 8, divides by 37 perfectly. Extremely parallel, extremely beautiful, spelled in 8 letters. Wow. Wow. There you have it. The spider web. And by the way, um, uh, this word here for spider, this is the word here for spider, is also a three-digit all-factor eight number. And furthermore, you know, let's do the math on it right now. It breaks down incredibly. I've, we just done the calculation right here. This is, uh, this is also a three-digit all-factor eight number. It, this literally means uh, like house, house of a spider, spider's web. Okay, both of these, um, both of these individual words are three-digit all-factor eight numbers. Let's write them out. We might as well get every ounce of glory out of this package. So here's the word spider, first of all, and watch how this breaks down amazingly. Spider, the word spider is 402. Now, immediately that is a three-digit, all-factor eight number to the glory of Jesus equals eight at eight. So instantly he takes the glory for every single spider on earth. Not to mention, of course, that they all have eight legs and produce silk that is stamped with eight molecularly. So here's spider, three digit all factor eight number. And furthermore, let's break that down now. That equals 67 
times 6. And now look, let's apply the law of prime to 67. 67 is the 19th prime times 6. 19 is also prime, so we apply the law of prime again, and it is our, it is our beloved one and only 8th prime. So there's our 8 shining through, just like that. Jesus equals 8 at 8, also divides by 6, takes the glory for every single 6 in the Bible. And definitively, 6 is most appropriately a pair of 3's. That is absolutely true. The 6 days of creation, for example, which is the first instance of 6 in the Bible, is emphatically a pair of 3's. The days come in pairs that fit with each other. Day 1 and day 4 are a pair, day 2 and day 5 are a pair, and day 3 and day 6 are a pair. In that the, the, the day in the following of the pair finishes the work that was begun in the first day of that pair. So, most appropriately, we write 8 um, times 6 to be like this. Two triples of 8, like this. And I'm leaving off the th to indicate that these are 8th prime. The law of prime simply says it's the number that declares its significance. So there you have it. That is what that number, number exactly boils down to. First of all, it's a three-digit all-factor 8 number. This is the word spider. And it boils down to, by the law of prime, it boils down perfectly to a double of triple eight namely 8 times 6, just like that. 6 is always a pair of 3's. That is how you are to look at the number 6 as a pair of 3's. Just like God pairs the three glyph roots in Hebrew all through the scripture. Three glyphs plus three glyphs equals 6. They are a pair of 3's. He pairs three glyph roots all through the scripture to make gorgeous multiples of 8. To the glory of Jesus equals 8 at 8. Wow, so there's the word spider. Amazing, eh? And and then just more even more astonishingly, this first word, house, is in the house of a spider. The word house is also a three digit all factor eight number, being exactly ten greater than the number spider itself, which is four oh two. So here you go. Look at that. All three of these, and then of course four oh two plus four twelve gives us our eight fourteen. So all of these numbers here are all three-digit, all-factor eight numbers to the glory of Jesus equals eight at eight. It is definitively the solution of every spider's web on earth to the glory of Jesus equals eight at eight. Amen. So now, are, are you starting to see how when you go out and you look at beautiful spider webs, wherever they may occur, they exist for the glory of one person and his name is Jesus equals 888 and we have just proven it mathematically along with all the other things that we are proving in all the universe on this YouTube channel keep watching and be amazed at how this one number Jesus equals 888 this one number literally takes the glory for everything in the entire universe Amen <laughs>